Exploring the Evolutionary History of Pembroke Welsh Corgis Pembroke Welsh Corgis A look at their evolutionary history Pembroke Welsh Corgis are one of the most recognizable dog breeds, known for their adorable stubby legs and charismatic personalities. But what is the evolutionary history behind these delightful dogs? In this article, we will dive into the origins and development of Pembroke Welsh Corgis, shedding light on their fascinating journey through time. To understand the origins of Pembroke Welsh Corgis, we need to go back in time to ancient Wales. It is believed that these dogs have been a part of Welsh history for over 3,000 years. The ancestors of Pembroke Welsh Corgis were brought to Wales by Flemish weavers during the 10th century. These weavers settled in Pembrokeshire, a county in southwest Wales, and brought along their herding dogs. These dogs would eventually mix with local Welsh herding dogs, giving rise to the breed we know today. The main purpose of these dogs was to help farmers in herding cattle and sheep. Their short stature was advantageous in avoiding kicks from livestock, and their quick and nimble movements allowed them to effectively herd small and agile animals. The Welsh called these dogs C-O-R-G-I, which translates to dwarf dog. The term Pembroke was later added to differentiate them from another Welsh corgi breed, the Cardigan Welsh Corgi. In the 1920s, the popularity of Pembroke Welsh Corgis soared when King George VI, then known as the Duke of York, acquired a corgi named Dookie. This marked the beginning of the breed's association with the British royal family, which continues to this day. The breed gained even more attention when Queen Elizabeth II received her first Pembroke Welsh Corgi, Dookie II, as a child. Since then, the Queen has owned more than 30 Corgis, making them a symbol of British royalty. From a genetic standpoint, Pembroke Welsh Corgis belong to the herding group, specifically the pastoral subgroup. Their genetic makeup is quite diverse, with various factors contributing to their unique appearance and temperament. One notable characteristic is their short legs, which are caused by a genetic mutation. This mutation affects the development of the long bones in their legs, resulting in the iconic stubby legs that Pembroke Welsh Corgis are known for. Their distinctive appearance is also enhanced by their fox-like face and large, erect ears. These features, along with their docked tails, give them a charming and distinct look. However, it's important to note that tail docking in Pembroke Welsh Corgis is now banned in several countries due to concerns about animal welfare. Temperament-wise, Pembroke Welsh Corgis are known for their intelligence, loyalty, and outgoing nature. They are highly trainable and make excellent family pets. Their herding instincts are still strong, and they may attempt to herd small children or other pets. Early socialization and training are essential to ensure they grow up to be well-rounded and well-behaved dogs. In recent years, there has been a rise in the popularity of Pembroke Welsh Corgis as pets, not just in Wales but around the world. This surge in demand has led to some concerns about the breed's health and welfare. Due to their unique body shape, Pembroke Welsh Corgis are prone to certain health issues, such as intervertebral disc disease and hip dysplasia. Responsible breeding and regular vet checkups are crucial to maintaining the breed's well-being. Being. In conclusion, Pembroke Welsh Corgis have a rich evolutionary history that dates back thousands of years. From their humble beginnings as herding dogs in Wales to their association with British royalty, these delightful dogs have captured the hearts of many. Their distinctive appearance, endearing personality, and strong herding instincts make them a beloved breed around the world. However, it is important to prioritize their health and welfare to ensure their well-being for generations to come.